The debate over the future of self-driving cars is picking up steam. KTV's Christian Captain joins us now live from the California Public Utilities Commission, where Waymo and crews are facing tough questions. Christian. Yeah, tough questions. Now, later on this week, the CPUC will be taking up the issue of possibly expanding the number of autonomous vehicles we see out there. But today, the issue was safety, and in particular, how those autonomous vehicles interact with emergency responders. Safety was the top concern for this California Public Utilities Commission meeting, bringing autonomous vehicle companies Waymo and Cruise face to face with first responders who've raised concerns about the vehicles. San Francisco Fire Chief Janine Nicholson saying there have been more than 50 cases of the self driving vehicles interfering with or impeding emergency responders so far this year. I understand and appreciate uh, the safety that. Um, uh, autonomous vehicles can bring to the table in terms of no drunk drivers, no speeding, all of that kind of stuff. However, they are still not ready for prime time because of how they have impacted our operations. Waymo and Cruise both cite safety stats saying their vehicles are safe. Cruise AVs have now driven over 3 million miles safely, the vast majority of which go unnoticed. The companies say the number of stopped autonomous cars is trending downward and that every instance is an opportunity to learn how to do better. Where there's an issue and the interaction does not go as well as it could, we work quickly with feedback from first responders to implement improvements. Outside, before the hearing, those opposed to autonomous vehicles like taxi driver Matthew Sutter held their own rally. He says expanding the number of autonomous vehicles on the roads would take away from his livelihood based on what he calls unproven technology. He says taxi drivers are already making half of what they did in 2010, and that's after he paid a quarter of a million dollars for his taxi medallion. I've been driving 31 years here in San Francisco, and, and I feel cheated. The PUC is set to meet again on Thursday to take up the issue about expanding autonomous taxi service. We're live in San Francisco. Christian Kafton, KTVU, Fox 2 News. Christian, thank you.